Hansel and Gretel Once upon a time in a faraway forest there lived a poor woodcutter his wife and the two young children the boy's name was Hansel and the girl was called Gretel the woodcutter was so poor that the family had very little food to eat so one night The woodcutter's wife said, We cannot take care of the children anymore. You must take them to the middle of the forest and leave them there. The two children heard the parents talk and they were very scared. We don't want to live in the forest, they said to each other. So, The clever children come up with a plan to save themselves. That night, they quite defied their pockets with tiny pebbles. The next morning, as the woodcutter took them to the middle of the forest, Hansel and Gretel dropped the pebbles all along the way. When the pal left them, all they had to do was to follow the line of the pebbles back home. The woodcutter and his wife were surprised to see the children back home. We must take them again tomorrow, they said. Hansel and Gretel were very worried now. All our families are gone. What do we do now? They cried. I have an idea, said Hansel. We can drop bread crumbs this time. So... The next morning, when the woodcutter took the children deep inside the forest to lead them there again, the children dropped crumbs of bread all along the way. But sadly for the children, the animals and birds had eaten up all the crumbs. Now Hansel and Gretel walked and walked but couldn't find their way back home. Suddenly, hidden in the trees, they saw a strange house made of candy, cookies, chocolate, and everything delicious. This is a gingerbread house, cried Gretel heavily. The children were so hungry that they started gobbling up the house at once. Now, this house actually belonged to an old witch who loved to eat little children. Just as Hansel and Gretel were eating her yummy door, she pounced on them and looked them inside. I shall pattern you up and eat you, she said with a weak look. The wicked witch locked Hansel in a cage, then... She turned to Gretel and said, You little girl, help me like the oven. When it's hot, I shall cook your brother and eat him up. Poor Gretel was so afraid. Gretel quietly took up a plan to save her brother. Just as the witch bent to check if the oven was hot, she gave her a big push from behind. The witch fell into the open with a scream and Gretel quickly locked the open door with a witch inside. Gretel rescued Hansel and the two children filled their pockets with all the witch juice. Finally, they managed to find their way back home and gave all the cheers to their mother and father. Thanks to the clever children, the woodcutter and his family were never poor or hungry ever again.